840. Just made four eggs, four sausage. I ended up deadlifting this morning. Usually I would get straight into a Bible study. You know, I kind of been rolling out of bed and getting straight in the Bible just to see uh, where I'm at, what I need to learn, what I could be better at. But recently, honestly, I haven't been feeling that great. Just like emotions, mental, just kind of feeling down, you know, just a little tired, kind of in the cycle again. You know what I'm saying? When you just feel like you start doing the same things over and over again. Also kind of feel like sometimes I have a lot to do, but I'm not getting a lot done. And I feel like every now and then, you know what I'm saying? I kind of run out of time or I'm not using my time well which is even more frustrating when like you know you could be doing something and you still don't do it so it's okay um but i ended up going for a walk just to kind of get out the house honestly it's nice and cold bro 47 degrees right now really just trying to get it back you know what i mean i feel like i've lost anything like mentally or anything but i feel like i should be doing better I feel like i should be a little happier a little more joyful um, and i was just kind of praying this morning just walking around just like because the bible says if you lack wisdom ask for wisdom so i was just out there and i'm like yo man like you know what's going on <laughs> you know like what what is it that I'm supposed to learn here? And every time I pray, it's more conversation. You know, it's really just like, God, I thank you. You know what I'm saying? I always start by thanking him for where I'm at, you know, because it could be worse. It always could be worse. But then it's just like, I just was trying to figure out, you know, what it is I'm supposed to be doing, you know, what it is I'm supposed to learn, what it is, you know, I'm supposed to be doing just kind of where I'm at, you know? Yeah, just like the last day or two, I just have not felt like, you know, like that boost of energy, you know, that super crazy excitement. And I don't know what to do. Honestly, I really don't. So this morning I pulled four. 50 got up around 7 this morning i rested in bed i laid in bed for a couple minutes and then i got up at 7 30. it's so bad that i actually have a different alarm on my phone now it's called loud alarm it's literally louder than the original clock because i would get the alarm on my normal phone like the, the iphone clock i would be so unmotivated to wake up that i would sleep through it so i ended up downloading another app that i use for my alarm now so that it's it's louder so that i'm like kind of forced to get up and get moving probably been using that for like a week straight i'm not really sure what it is i'm not really sure what's going on but i am gonna pray you know i have been praying still worshiping man still got the worship music you know what i'm saying so i mean here's you are my strength so it's not like i'm falling away from it i'm not angry or anything like that but i feel like i could be a lot more joyful you know right now i just kind of don't feel that that's just kind of how the morning's been you know just kind of chilling walking around we are gonna go read shortly you know, i'll let you guys know kind of what we read but i just was thinking like i've been having a lot of energy drinks sometimes during the day before practice and i don't know if you guys can tell 
but my eyes are like low-key heavy so if i'm just like sitting here like my eyes are low-key you know what i'm saying i don't know if i'm not i'm probably not sleeping enough to be honest but i feel like i have things that i should be doing you know that are kind of greater than sleep at the time you know anyways man i don't, don't want to gap but i just want to be honest about this video i really just picked up the camera because i was like man like i gotta figure this out <laughs> you know what i'm saying i hope you guys have a great day thank you guys for clicking on the video watching the video tuning in to another day in the life just trying to get after it and do you know what god's given us the ability to so let's work hard man and uh yeah man Hey guys, it's Yates and Trey. We have bad news. So Isaiah had his uh, meeting today, and I hate to break it to y'all, but we're gonna have to be taking over the content now because Isaiah got cut. The coach told him he was really bad. He just couldn't be here anymore. So yeah, we're gonna be taking over the channel from now on. You can unsubscribe if you'd like, but I'm sorry. Everybody, this is Isaiah reading his Bible. We just went to Texas Fruit House and then Isaiah got. What are you reading in? Colossians. Learning about worship. Alright, guys, it's late. I'm about to get ready for bed. Just actually finished reading. We're reading over there in Colossians 3.16. Just learning more about worship, how important it is, what God acts of us. Some kind of cool stuff like that. I did end up having a great day today. I got some good work in. We do have a game tomorrow morning. Right now, it's like 11.50, so I actually want to get ready for bed right now. But find a way to be at his feet. Find a way to quiet the world. Find a way to be in his presence. Find a way to learn something. Find a way to listen to some worship. Like, put yourself in an uncomfortable position to be at his feet and truly try to hear what God is saying to us. You know what I'm saying? In the season or wherever place place you're in you know whatever you have going on just be in a place to listen be in a place to hear what he has for us and that's what i've been working on you know what i'm saying um, it's a lot going on a lot of chaos in this world but find a way to hear the voice of god put yourself in a position to kind of surrender to just give it all and just be ready to kind of buy in and listen to what he has for us so catch you guys bro because we got a game tomorrow so i'm gonna go ahead and hit the bed bed i'm probably gonna wake up at seven i gotta be at the field by nine so we're just gonna make it do what it do try to catch a barrel tomorrow have some fun. So Colossians 316 issue sure freaking get after it and see what the Lord has for you. Yes, sir. Dig it. <laughs> <laughs> 
Alright guys, so I am uh, back home. Uh, we left this morning around 7.45. Probably got home around 2 o'clock. It's just 3 o'clock now. I've been home like an hour. Loki just sitting here. Pretty solid day. Mainly hitting driven. Not a whole lot done on defense. Like I think somebody got thrown out and that was it. But base knock to start the game. The middle as you guys saw. I got hit in the elbow again. I had to change up in the 5-6 hole. And then I got the two strikes. Just kind of put a ball in play. Hit the ball hard. The cool thing and the good thing is that I'm seeing the ball well. You know what I'm saying? Barrel the ball up. Early and often. You know what I'm saying? Uh, not really chasing at all like not swinging at bad pitches everything is in the zone i'm getting pitches i can handle um, but the other side of it is it's time to start elevating the ball hitting some doubles hitting some homers and i need to just finish off my swing just a little more a little more behind it really finish over my shoulder a lot more instead of kind of building it down so instead of getting to the ball here and just kind of crashing it over i need to get here and finish it up and that's going to help the ball just kind of take off a little more but very subtle change you know what i'm saying we have another game tomorrow tonight i'm going to lift i need to get some food for now i need to straighten up change clothes get out of these baseball pants you guys man solid day at the field one for one i think and i think the rest will probably be errors you know i'm not going to count those i'm just going to count the true hit so one for one probably scored two or three runs today you know on the base pass so solid day Man, oh man. Mm -mm -mm. One love, man. Roll fins. Hey, Mama, Mama, Mama. Alright, guys, so I'm gonna give y'all a little update really quick just on the day, how things are going, how we're feeling. That's that's what we're gonna do. So, just finished playing a game. We've been there all day. It's 4.50. We lost today. We have not been playing that great as a team, just all around. Just We just haven't done that great. It's okay. We'll figure something out and. We'll keep playing. Physically, I think I went two for three today. I need to change my swing a little bit. I don't want to change it too much because I'm seeing the ball well and hitting the ball hard. But I'm just, I'm thinking longevity. You know what I'm saying? I want some more doubles. I want some more home runs. And I feel like there's something I can do to my swing. So we're going to work on that. We'll figure that out. Talk about that this week. I just want to start as a team player. A guy who loves to win, man. There's only one thing you control, man. Attitude and effort, right? Your effort towards the game, your effort for your teammates, and your attitude, how you show up every day, how you show up as a team player, as your teammate, um, it's a big deal, you know what I'm saying, for you and for me. But one thing you control is yourself, you know what I'm saying? You can't control the pitcher, you can't control the umpire, you can't control the reactions of others, you can't control people chirping you, you can't control any of that stuff. All you can control is your own stuff, your own emotions, your own work, your own training. That's what you can control. At the end of the day, man, if you say you're a believer, man, you have to act like a believer. If you want to be outside, you can go be outside. But you can only control what you can control, you know? And if you have expectations for your friends or buddies and stuff like that, you got to realize at the end of the day, man, you can only do what you can do. So just kind of keep that in mind, you know what I'm saying? Don't be so hard on each other. Don't be so hard on yourself, man. Baseball's hard. Life is hard. Games are hard. The other thing is that you never know what people have going on outside of the field. So outside of the field, people have things that they may be going on that you have no idea about. You know what I mean? Like sometimes it's a struggle for me to get to the field. Sometimes mentally I'm tired. Sometimes, you know what I'm saying? Not everybody knows what's going on, but you can only do what you can do. You know what I'm saying? So just keep that in mind. For the rest of the day, man, I'm going to get a pretty good lift in. We're going to lift pretty heavy. I'm not going to lie. I don't feel that great. Not that happy, excited. I did. Uh, I don't like to lose, man. I really don't. I, I, I try my best to, to do what I can to help everybody. You know what I'm saying? Help the team. Do the I'm a team guy, bro. You know what I mean? Regardless of my own performance, I do whatever I can to help our guys. I'll do whatever I can to help the next man. That's just who I am, bro. That's what I believe in. And I want others to do that for me. You know? We got a lift tonight. We're going to hit reverse lunge. Probably pretty heavy. I'm going to wait till the sun goes down so I can relax. You know, in my room, just kind of do some things around the crib. Thank you guys for all the support, man. We're going to keep pushing. It's not the end. It's the beginning, man. Just continue learning. Keep playing hard. Just do it you can do man control the controllable see you guys a little later we're gonna relax for a little bit and we'll get into the lift downstairs so we'll keep working hard man
Well, it's kind of late. We actually did 370 on the lunch today. I felt pretty good. I felt pretty strong. I'm not gonna lie. And then like I went to our call it what you want, but I'm about to be locked in. And I have been, but the winter, the weather's colder, and, and I just feel like it's a chance to focus just a little more. So I'm actually editing right now. I'm trying to chop this video up. Right now it's kind of late. I'm not gonna lie. 106 a.m. Got church in the morning, so kind of resting up, chilling, just working on this. We'll get going with tomorrow and whatever else it has in store for us. So see you guys. Hope you enjoyed the video. Maybe in the next week or two i'll hit 405 again and we'll hit that on lunges so see you guys next video bye guys